accommodate muscles, transfer muscles from other parts of the body and rewire nerves. So when the patient tries to do movements with his missing hand, those um, new muscular structures get activated and, and then we put electrodes inside them so we can extract that information use an artificial intelligence algorithm to, to look at those electrical um, uh, pulses that come from all the different sources and, and learn what is the patient trying to do. And once it's learned, uh, which happens very quickly, then you can tell the prosthesis what to do. One of the, the important parts of our work on translational research is to, uh, not only to show that something is possible, but to communicate it so other people can use it. Those are ongoing efforts, and, um, and we hope that we can bring this uh, technology to more people relatively soon. Thank you.